Namaste, Cancer. How are y'all doing today? So grateful you could be here. I'm going to give you a quick tarot reading. These are general readings, so take what resonates with you. Leave a comment if it does. Don't forget to like and subscribe below to stay posted on all your videos. We will get started right away. So general feelings, I feel you have a, an outpouring of love coming towards you. Also, open yourself to receiving love. Uh, learn to love yourself to receive more love. This might not just be love, it could be inspiration. So use your instincts on any messages or inspiration that are coming towards you at this time. Also, don't forget to pause, reflect, have a little solitude in your life. Take a little time for meditation, self-reflection. Uh, some of you might have a little lack mindset going on right now, like thinking you're not good enough or that you can't do something. Um, so yeah, just be mindful of that negative mindset. Get rid of it because you have a lot of love coming in towards you, a lot of opportunity coming towards you right now. Got a new mic, so feeling pretty good about that. Also got a message of recovery, so some of you might be seeking treatment, um, whether it's therapy, counseling, medical treatment. So some, some of you might be going through that. Also got the message of movement away from not so much danger, but uh, something that's just not working for you anymore, but it'll lead to something so much better. Also got the message of like widow or divorcee or just a general feeling of wanting to be independent or being fine with independence. Yeah, an outpouring of love coming towards you. And also you just wanting to put your personal love into everything that you do. Some of you might be feeling anxious or have some anxiety at night. Um, so just be aware of that and try to get a little comfortable uh, before you go to bed. Right. I feel like a lot of you have been just wanting to expand your horizon, um, explore new opportunities for growth, waiting for an opportunity. You've been pretty patient about this. In the recent past, maybe you've been uh, surrounding yourself with people who are inspiring you for expansion and growth. Like you have the support of the community. Like I said earlier, I feel like you have a flow of love coming towards you. So I feel like new friendships might be on the horizon. horizon. Some of you might even want to travel. Uh, maybe that was what I was feeling earlier with wanting to move away. There's a lot of travel in mind for some of you. All right, you have the Page of Cups. Like I said earlier, be open to receiving messages, receiving love. Um, the Page of Wands could just be sending that to you right now. It's also a very youthful cast of mind. Maybe bring a little more playfulness into your life or, or if you're starting like a new project, go into it with like a youthful cast of mind, very curious about how you should go about the whole situation, the whole project. All right, with the Ace of Wands, it's like a magic wand right here. Uh, I feel like you have new inspiration, new creativity that you want to get started or you have already started. I feel like definitely in the near future, you will be starting a new creative project or something that just inspires you. But you should definitely take action on these uh, new creative ideas that you have coming to you. The Ace of Wands is just the spark of inspiration. So that's totally up to you on what you want to do with that creative energy. The Wands is very fiery too. So Maybe some of you might want to get started on a new health routine or uh, hit the gym. Um, 
and and just get that fire on your ass also another card of travel so i mean some of you might be planning a traveling soon very nice what are some obstacles you should be aware of right now oh that one wanted to fly out You're getting the King of Cups in reverse and the Two of Wands. Usually the King of Cups right side up is uh, very stable emotionally. Uh, so I feel like, and this is a card of plans for the future. So maybe you're letting your emotions distract you from making that decision or choice on your future plans right now. So that's your obstacle. What else should Cancer be aware of right now? Alright, and then you get the Ace of Wands. So yeah, be aware of that spark in you. And I'll light that fire with uh, whatever creative project or inspiration that you have right now. And you get the Page of Cups as well. So you just had those. That's crazy. What else should you be aware of? Uh, yes, yeah, so like the Four of Swords, that's um, uh, taking time to reflect, um, take some time for introspection and uh, meditation, um, rest, pause, reflect. Feeling, stop. All right. I feel like you need to find a little balance and stability um, in your social life and your work life right now. With that Queen of Swords right here, know that you are smart, you're determined, uh, you are resilient. Yeah, start thinking rather than feeling. Uh, that will lead you to the Ace of Pentacles, um, which will bring you so much prosperity with whatever creative project that you have coming your way right now. So, you got that. All right, uh, with this Hanged Man, take a step back um, observe what's going on change your perspective a little bit uh, the seven of swords in the middle this guy is being very strategic in how he is moving forward this is also a deceptive card so i don't know if maybe uh something someone might be lying to you or deceiving you in some way or maybe you are deceiving yourself maybe you're lying to yourself in some way the knight of swords is telling you to move forward with um, whatever idea you have going on right now uh, it's also a truth seeker so i don't know if someone's lying here i don't know take what resonates with you all right i'm just going to give you one last message here So you get the roots of abundance. You're anchoring yourself into these deep roots and you are feeling stable and feeling secure in your life right now. Life happens for you, not to you. Nothing can uproot you right now, no matter what you do. Know that your life is safe and secure. All your hopes, your dreams, they are firmly rooted into the ground right now. They're not just going to blow away. Look at how strong this tree is. Know that growth is not a straight line and that everything happens for a reason. Everything that you need will come into your life when you need it. This plant is fully rooted into the ground, into this earth, just like your creative ideas. So go with that. Uh, shining through. This is at the bottom of the deck. Uh, quiet your mind and keep your ears wide open. And that's when you'll truly feel the world.
All right, well, that's your reading. I hope it helped you out. If any of it resonated, make sure you comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Namaste. Thank you.